My name is David Kaplan. I, I was born near Boston. I live in Ohio where I'm an associate professor at Ohio Western University. I'm a poet and a critic of poetry. So I came here for this semester to teach uh, American literature at the University of Liege. I had a similar fellowship with Fulbright eight years ago and I came across that because they were looking for someone in the field of poetics, which is my scholarly subfield. And I, I was looking at the Fulbright website and I came across it and I contacted Professor Michelle Delville, who is a professor at the University of Liège, and we started a correspondence. He works on similar issues uh, to those that I work on. I came and I enjoyed it, and then I saw they had another fellowship, so I wanted to come back. So I, uh, so I corresponded again, and it worked out. Well, I was a professor at that time also. It was a similar teaching award, uh, my first Fulbright. Uh, I thought it was fantastic. I thought it was really lively and very interesting to teach American literature outside of America, which was a uh, uh, which was an unusual situation for me, and I saw that certain texts, for example, I taught Walt Whitman, who's going to be America's great poet, and it was the first time that I taught him to people who primarily were not American citizens. So I ended up learning quite a bit from my students and rethinking American literature, um, getting ready to teach it to uh, a different student population. I think the best opportunity that, it, that came from being a Fulbright was just expanding my notion of American literature and looking at it from different perspectives, both from the students and from the faculty, which I would not have been exposed to otherwise. I think it's a fantastic opportunity to live abroad and to meet a variety of people from different backgrounds, to talk about literature or whatever your specialty is. I would recommend if people are interested in pursuing a Fulbright, they spend some time with the website and see um, if there's positions that align with their particular interests, and if so, I'd, I'd encourage them to contact the people listed on the website and develop a correspondence. Mm -hmm. And that way they can get a better sense of both the position and if it seems to be a good fit for both sides. Mm -hmm. One strategy that I pursued was I, again, I looked at the website and I saw a university that wanted, seemingly wanted something similar to what I do. So I corresponded with the contact person and then I arranged for a letter of invitation. And even though that wasn't required. And that seems to be a strategy of of reaching out to the people at the university where you want to be and uh, establishing contact with them. Well, Belgium is really a lively, interesting country with at least two major linguistic communities and a third smaller linguistic community and a diverse culturally uh, with a rich intellectual tradition. So I found it really a stimulating place to be and so I'm excited to be back.